Tom Callahan, Chairman of the Zoning Bylaw Committee and Chairman of the Planning Board. Last forum, we discussed uh, housing issues, some of the state mandates that we're subject to, as well as housing diversity and multifamily housing. And we also talked about accessory dwelling units. Well, we, we, uh, we had a great presentation at this forum. Uh, our town planner, Lauren Lind, and a member of the uh, Met Metropolitan Area Planning Council were there to speak about state mandates. We went over Chapter 40B, where we stand on compliance with that. As people know, that's a, a, a state law that requires us to keep 10% of our housing stock as affordable. If we do not meet that threshold, we are subject to possibly having a, a large, undesirable project uh, built in the community. So right now we're in what's called a safe harbor. We're in compliance, but we still have to keep thinking about each 10 year census when the numbers change and, and keep planning to keep ourselves at that 10% threshold. Uh, we also talked briefly about the, the new mandate for housing in proximity to MBTA stations and what we would have to do to deal with that. And uh, then we had an excellent presentation for Woody Chittick of the ZBA about our current accessory dwelling bylaw, why it's not used very much, and what we might do to improve it and, and make some changes to it, such as allowing uh, units to be built in sort of an accessory building like a shed or a garage that's not attached to the house. You know, I think we got some good feedback, especially about accessory dwelling units. I think. Generally, there was a sentiment about keeping the bylaw and fixing it and encouraging the use of accessory dwelling units. The forum on the 5th is going to be focused on environmental issues and it's really looking towards the future and looking at some new trends in development, low impact development, so-called green development, and then also planning for climate change and building climate resiliency. So it's really, uh, it'll be issues that are all going to be new initiatives in the bylaw that, you know, provisions that we do not have now that we're thinking about for the future. The meeting will be Monday, December 5th at uh, 7 o'clock at the Senior Center. We'll also be broadcasting it on Zoom and on 143 TV.